Hello my fan pals and welcome back and if you're new here then thank you for joining me and giving me a try. My name is Di, I am here at Creative Karma Design and today I have another use all of the stickers in the sticker books where I show you how to use some of the perhaps weird, odd, unusual stickers and how you can get them from your sticker book and into your planner. This is for Super Happy, this is from 2022. I bought this because I just love the fact that it's a bright color palette and it's a little bit retro. If you find it and you're like, eh, I'm not really sure about it, but I'll try, and then you're struggling with it, that's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. So this is clearly for the dashboard. These little boxes are for the dashboard planner. You don't have to use them in the dashboard planner. You can use them in your regular vertical, your regular horizontal or whatever. And then this bit, all you have to do is either put one of these little headers over the top or you just get another box and you just layer it on top and you just cover it that way. Um, you could also just put another circle or something, like a circle, you know, like some kind of other sticker, whether it's a box or something. But yeah, some kind of other sticker can go on there. These, I, I like them, <laughs> that's just me. But if you don't like them, you could cut them into little bullets that way you could cut them in half that way and have two sets of little bullets and if you still feel like they look like faces and you're not sure about them you could cut them in half that way you could cut them in half that way and have little little dots there and then on this side you've got like a little circle so yeah you don't feel you have to be forced to keep these as is this one you could also if you wanted to just cut it there and have a decorative box and then this one you could use one of these headers you could use something else like another box or something or a little one of the little tiny boxes and put that there but yeah lots of things you can do with those other than use them as is again even one of these you could put here so yes again these are for the monthly because they've got the little notch taken out of them doesn't mean to say that you have to use them in the monthly. I've got a whole video all about monthly boxes. I will link that here, but if I remember, but all you have to do is get another box and just kind of cover that corner. And it can be any size box, just got to cover the corner. The other thing that you can do is if you have a monthly box, you can put them together that way. If you don't, if you can't cover the corner, you can put them together that way and have them short edges together is that what I want to say so yes lots of things you can do with those like these as well you could even and this one you could cut them down cut them down there and just have a rectangular box cut that there and have a rectangular box you could cut this one and this one into little strips of washi these if you don't like the flagged end they've got like little flags on the end like the little double ended thing if you don't like that just cut it off and make it flat or you could cut it and make it the other way so it's a point like an arrow so lots of things you can do there these are on clear and I say this all the time but if you are doing this especially this one and you're like I don't have anywhere that big you can just cut them choose kind over cool and just have it horizontally instead. You don't have to have it vertically like this, even though it looks kind of nice, you don't have to. You can do it to fit whatever. Like if you have enough space, but you can't get the happy on there, put the happy here so that the happy goes here instead, just goes there. So yes. And even then, like if you just want to use this, this smiley and use something else here, you can just cut the smiley off and use the smiley. Just saying. Just saying and even like those smileys even these if you have a word just as they've done here you can if you have an o you like okay i want another one of these here you can cut them out cut them out put another one of these here instead these are four i'm gonna say the horizontal weird that we've got an assortment of stickers but i like it i like these as well but again, if you're not sure, they look nice just on the corner of a box. If you put that underneath and you have it underneath the corner of a box, 
You could literally just put them as they are in the sidebar. You could put them underneath a piece of washi, have them going in horizontal. This is nice, but if you just like, I want just enjoy every moment, you could literally just cut the blue there and there, and then have three different headers there. You could do little washi strips, lots of things you can do with these, but they're very nice as they are. And they're just the same. Yeah, they're the same, but with foil, which is weird, but here we are. But yeah, same, but in foil. These, I love these. So these are circles and I love these because I get two ways to use these. I can use the circles, which I tend to use them the same as I said about these. You can use them down the sidebar and you just have a bunch down the sidebar. You can use them underneath some washi, use them horizontally. You can use them on the edge of a box, at the top of a box. But I save the background on these and I've shown you how to do this. It makes a great way to do a currently page or a gratitude or something like that. And the way that I did it previously, or that I've done it previously, is I took the sheet, I cut it there. So I had two holes because they were the holes at this point, and then one hole on this side. On the left-hand side, I think I put two, and on the right-hand side, I put one, and then I just had like little gratitude bits in each one. I really would look, look forward to doing that again, because there's lots of these now when they're doing this. I just love it. The little circles, they're perfect. But you could also do it horizontally and do it this way, across the bottom of the page, where it's great for currently. But I like these. I like these quite a lot. These are lovely, they're so fun. But if you don't like the focus, focus, you can just cut that off and just have a box. Again, this could just be cut in half. These little things, I've done a video all about flags, but I like putting them at the bottom of my boxes. They work great as little to-do lists, stuff like that. Oh, I've got two pages of them, that's nice. And in different colors. I love that, thank you, Happy Planner. These are lovely and I will say, I will say again, I, I, same as the the background on these, you could do the same with this because they're cut in such a way that all of that will come off the page. You see how then you've got this green background, then you've got the blue. So we've got a nice kind of um, almost like a rainbow-ish effect here. If you took this background off and then just mounted it on a piece of paper, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven little like journaling spots that you could use on a page very, very easily. But these I like to put as little bits on the top of a box and the bottom of a box. I like to put them on my monthly as well, just to fill in the little gaps. I I absolutely love these bits. I love these bits. And you're not forced to keep them the size that they are. Like you look at this, it says you've got this. I would cut that down. I would take the excess green off of there and just cut it down. And you can flag the end and stuff like that. I freaking love, I need to do a video all about these. If I have done it already, I will link it. But yes, I love them. These all say today, which pisses me off. I'm just gonna say it, it pisses me off. If you don't want the today, you just gotta get your little white out. Cause today only works if you're not using it in if you're only going to use it in your daily, if you want to use it in the sidebar, you don't want today. So just white it out. Just white it out is what I would do. These I don't like as much as the other ones. I would rather these be like different colors. This is a very weird color. It's a very weird color. But again, flags, I've already shown you how to use and it just works the same. I like them on the edge, little bits on my box. I like them as a little, um, almost like a checklist. Yeah, almost like a checklist. I've done it where I've done them on the sidebar. You just use them coming out the sidebar. Just, if you're gonna use them, use all of them is what I will say, commit. Especially when they're like this with the faces, you can't turn those as much, but you could if you cut them down. You cut that to there. You can't even see that that was supposed to be a smiley face. It just looks like a little half circle. So yeah, if you're struggling with them, cut the suckers down. Same as these. If you find that you've got no gold on the page, but you've run out of these boxes and you're like, I don't want to use these because they've got gold on them. Just wipe the sucker out. Just wipe it out. These I love. And again, save the background because 
I was going to show you, you take that off there, you've got little circle strips. You've got little circle strips. And you could literally have a whole circle strip, to do strip there. You could cut them up. Like I need to do a whole video on how to use a sheet like this. Maybe that's coming soon. I don't know. But these, you could use them. Again, we talked about that about in that um, in that quote. You could use them as the O, like they have here. You could use them as the O here, right? So you could use them as O's. You can use them again as bullets. Just cut them in half. Just cut them in half. You can use them again as circles. Just put a washi strip and then just commit to a whole row of little smiley faces. I love them, but again, I'm more excited about that behind it <laughs> because I'm weird. I don't know why they're on clear. I'm not sure why they're on clear, but I do like them quite a lot. Oh, and we've got some gold ones. Oh, that would be handy for those. Look at those gold circles. Yes. So, and here's the thing, like if you were doing this in a, same, same with this one, if you were doing this in a sidebar, all you had to do was take a strip there, there, cut that there, take the background, put it in the sidebar, and you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 18 little spots that you could put some journaling in or something. Use the background, friends. Use the background. But as the background, I love that. These are beautiful. They're so fun. If you don't like the fact that they're smiley faces and that's what puts you off, you can. Just get a little sticker paper. This is um, an Avery sticker paper label dot thing. Just put a little sticker there. If you don't like it, just put a little sticker in there. Big deal, right? Big deal. I wonder if you can actually, I don't think, because they're the same size. Yeah, they're the same size. But if you had these and you wanted gold in the middle, you could just take your little smiley and put a smiley in there and have your gold one instead. Oh, hang on, don't stick. So there's that, but I love these. I love these as accents, but commit to it. Commit to it. Don't just put one on a page. Either put them all on a page, <laughs> like really commit. You want at least three. You want at least three. But I would probably just use all of them. Ha! <laughs> That's literally what I just said, right? Put the gold one in the middle. So if you wanted more with the gold, use the gold ones from here and put those in there. But yeah. Um, they will also work good as um, the bit for the monthly where it's got no dates, just chuck all of these in, like cut them up and just fill that space, almost like a little patterned paper. Fill the space, friends. Oh, this washi is very cute. This green is a very weird green. But again, think about this afterwards as journaling spots, like where that washi is, take the washi off and you've got a little journaling spot there. So yes, use all of the stickers. If you don't like the fact that it's got this wiggly design, and you know, you might not, I like it. Cut it there. But yeah, you could just cut that horizontally and get way more washy out of that. Way more washy. Oh, these are cute. These are cute. So this has got a very versatile, we've got dashboard, we've had horizontal, we've had monthly, and now we've got vertical. This is beautiful. These are beautiful, I love them. But. This could be a little washi box. You could you could just cut that into washi strips. Again, these, if you're going to use them, commit, but you could, if you wanted to, cut them down in half, use them as bullets. You could use them to redate with as well, with the little, um, the little washi dots. You put a little washi dot or something in there. Let's say yeah, that was white. Then you could put a little white dot in there and use them to redate with, because there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there's eight, so that would be actually possible, yes. So yeah, that's also another thing that you can do with those, sorry, with these, you can use them to redate with, not the, the smileys, but this bit, this bit behind it, use them as little, little redating spots. Oh, that's beautiful, oh, oh yes, oh, oh yes, but again, if you don't like it, cut it into washi, either way, or headers, washi, washi. Tons of ways to use those. Oh, these are nice. Not today, my friend, not today. Again, if you don't like them, because they say the same thing on the top as to the bottom, 
you could get double the amount of stickers here just by, you could even just cut that there, small sliver, you could cut it there and just have the eyes and then on that side you've got the little half circle. You could get double the amount of stickers there and then save the sheet because you've got the little circle. Just plop it down on your currently page and you've got all the circles for your currently prompts or a journaling page for something. Oh, we've got two pages. Same thing. Going on an adventure. Going on an adventure. That's just weird that it's going on an adventure. Love your fabulous self. Yes. And again, save the sheet, plop it down on the page, and then you've got a sheet of just circles, of just circles. And these would be beautiful in the sidebar as well. Very big in the sidebar. Quite like that. Got some quotes on clear. Every day, yay, you got this. Again, you got this could be you got this rather than vertical, have it horizontal. Same as this, that is the same saying as earlier. That's actually the same, it's the same page pretty much. Yeah, they've just done it in gold. It's the same, the same as that. And that's the same, it's just in gold. And smaller, clearly. I just don't know why they do this. Don't know why they do this. That should be there. That should be there. You're going to put more quotes together on clear. That should be there. So again, look on the bright side. You can cut all that up, have it horizontal. Again, this, if you want it along both pages, you could put it along both pages, discovering who you are meant to be. And it just goes horizontal instead. And even then, like, you've got hooray there, you've got yay there, they go together. Why are they trying to mix everything up? Annoying. But another yay. It's the same freaking quote. I mean, they could have found different quotes. Really? One, two, three times that's in here. <laughs> three times. In a different iteration it's in here three times but again it doesn't have to be stacked like that you can have it horizontal you can have it however you want it it's your planner cut the stickers up these are great i love these i love to put these like at the bottom of a box somewhere here like just in a, in a box especially a double box it just looks really nice you could just put this in the sidebar it can be in your monthly i love these just so fun. And if you don't like plan on it, you can just put plan. If you don't like hello weekend, you can just put weekend and you've got hello that you can put somewhere else. And even if you don't want weekend, hello week, or you can mix them up. You can mix them up. Yeah, you can just kind of mix these up if you wanted to. But if you really wanted to get like mm, in the weeds, you could even cut up the individual letters. I'm just saying. I'm just saying you could if you wanted to. You could. Oh, and you've got two pages of those with different things. Hooray, shine bright. That seems a weird one. Today is magic. So you could put magic weekend. <laughs> I'm literally saying that because my husband and I were saying, we used to be like, you know, oh, I need to do so-and-so. We need to do A, B, and C. We used to call it magic weekend where we would try and get everything done at the weekend. So so that makes sense for us, Magic Weekend. So we can, we do, we do everything, but then we get nothing done. So Magic Weekend. But yes, just joy. You can just have joy. Today is magic. Magic. Smile. You don't need smile big. You can have big weekend. Big weekend. So yes, you can like cut these up and then interchange. You can put plan your weekend, plan your week. There you go. And then you've got a different one that says weekend. So yeah, change those up. These are beautiful. I quite like these. So just plan on it, plan on it. So much to do, get it done. Brunch with friends. I don't like that one. I would probably just cut that off. Cut the, cut the brunch with friends off. And then you've got another sticker that's just got the flower. And I don't do brunch either. So yeah, but you could cut that like there, date night, plan on it, 
again, you could cut that in half and get double the amount of the little stickers. Oh God, I missed a page. Oh, same thing, but not in, um, not in gold, but same, yeah, same designs, but just not in gold. So again, if you wanted the same thing, but you didn't want the gold, you could put that on there. The other thing that if you, if you wanted, if you want this, the date night, but you don't want the flower, maybe you want to put it over one of those other circle things, like one of these, you could just cut that off there and then stick it on top of one of these. Alphabets, I've gone over before. These you can actually change, again, I've gone over these. These you can actually change. So although it says there, get it girl, and it's supposed to be like this, you can use it like that in a box. So you could put it like across your box like that. What I would probably do, because I don't like that, is I would change it, do that flat, and then give that one of those so that it's actually a point instead. So yes, I would probably change it more to that and use it as like my priority of the day or something like that. So yes, I think that's it. All right, so that is super happy how to use all the stickers. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And I will see you next time, my planner pals. Bye.